how to use ChatGPT instead of Siri on your iPhone. We all know that Siri is a very outdated version of Voice Assist. As an alternative, we can now add ChatGPT to it. If you want to find out how you can do this, stay until the end of the video. The first thing we're going to do is open the link found in the description of this video. When the link has opened, all that is needed is to click on the Get Shortcut button. A pop-up will appear asking us if we want to open the shortcut application. Tap the Open button. Further, all you need to do is to confirm your choice by clicking the Add Shortcut button. I already added it so I won't do that. If you did everything right, this shortcut should appear on your home screen of the shortcut application. Now half the work is already done, and we can implement this option. If you have an iPhone that has an action button, you can set it to activate via it. However, if you don't have one, there is an alternative. Open the settings on your phone. Once the settings have opened, scroll through the options until you find the accessibility section. When you find it, tap on it. In the new menu, select the touch option. At the bottom of the list that opens, you will find the back tap option. Tap on it. Choose one of the options. Since double tap is already in use, I will choose triple tap. In the next window, scroll through the options until you find the start voice conversation with chat GPT option and tap on it. And that's all. Now you can activate ChatGPT with a tap on the back of the phone, tell him something and he will perform the search for you. Also, if you tap on the button with the X sign, you can interrupt the announcer and read everything he has to say. This is a much better way to search for things than Siri can offer you. Please note that ChatGPT 4.0 is a limited version for a certain number of minutes if you do not have a subscription, so after some time it will go to the older version 3.5. That's all for this video. If you found this tutorial helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, subscribe for more similar tips, and hit that notification bell so you never miss an update from us. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.